the hell is this? It's a zygomatic bone. Can you can you orient it so that it will fit up on this guy? It would be in somewhat like that. Yeah, good. Well, a little bit farther back. Okay. Yeah. So it's going to have a face here. This little process, oops, this little process that connects up with the maxilla and then where you're holding it on the back, that's actually the um, temporal process of the zygomatic bone. So hold it from this part up here. Hold it from the orbital part. That's okay. All right, good. So this little loser process is the temporal process of the zygomatic bone. <laughs> Here's what really stinks. This then is the maxillary process of the zygomatic bone because it joins up with the maxilla, right? So it joins up. That's right. That's where it joins over here. Then this is the zygomatic process. Sorry, the temporal process of the zygomatic bone, which then this is the wrong side, but it's then going to meet up with the zygomatic process of the temporal bone. Don't like it? Don't blame you. But the main thing to remember is that each of these processes is named for the bones that it points to. Um, so, and I usually throw in the bone name as well because that kind of helps to pull it all together.